at seven of those helpers. Officials tonight, Roger Ayers, Doug Shows, and Joe Lindsay. And it will be Louisville controlling the opening tip. Right out of the gate, a turnover for Louisville. And coming off that loss to DePaul on the road, and they started off very sluggishly in that game. Returning starter from last year, had 18 last time out. J.J. Trainer still out with that shoulder. And the freshman, Tyler Johnson, making his first career start. Nice touch on the inside by the big man, Brandon Huntley. Losing to DePaul on the road because this is a very poor DePaul team so far this season. Another turnover. That's four the other way. Freddie Hicks for the easy two. And right now, Louisville, they do not. Johnson drops it off. Nice move by the freshman to get it to Huntley Hatfield. Has a lot of energy. They're used to playing on the road, and they're playing with some confidence early. They do not have an answer for Huntley Hatfield, who's got all six for Louisville. Well, that's just way too easy, though. Huntley Hatfield just posted up, carved the space out on the box, and no resistance from Louisville. Strong move inside by Caleb Fields, fifth-year senior and a five-year starter. Lord Johnson, the freshman, the top 100 player. There is talent. But tonight for Arkansas State, the veteran point guard making a rebound to Dominguez. Huntley Hatfield's got good post moves down low. He can see if they can go through him. But Kenny Payne telling us earlier today, this team has to buy into we, not me. As that time, they left the back door open, and Arkansas State makes them pay. And Kenny Payne is challenging his veterans, the transfers. Well, sometimes when you put new pieces together that fits, and sometimes like Oklahoma has done this year. Well, Johnson is one guy that can come into the lineup and run the team and more efficiently than others. He's got a decent assist to turnover ratio, which you know it's going to be fast paced. Arkansas State is going to do that, push it. And launch it over. Front rim, offensive rebound, Nelson. Feltz is a sharpshooter. Dominguez from the corner, and he knocks down the triple. But I still think you need a balance. Well, you got to defend the post right there. Isaiah Nelson wide open. Just a lack of communication. This is Donalo Jovanovic. Miami transfers to second game. Good possession defensively for Louisville. Had good pressure on the ball and a good contest. Clark knocks down the 18-footer. There's the long start of the mid-range game. Clark the catch and shoot. He's got four. 7-0 run for Louisville. Hicks twisting inside for two. They had the floor space. They reversed it and got an open shot. Clark this time trying to go solo. Loose ball. And Sky Clark right there on cleanup duty. Well, sometimes, though, when you bring back starters, three starters from a team that won four games, that's not always a good thing. So there's a reason you only won four games. Those guys were a big part of it. Hicks. Pretzels inside. Over the trees. Offensive rebound. It's Lacou. This is how we play. We need a good stretch four on the floor at all times. Feltz wanted the three. It's not there. And they get the other three off the wing at Arkansas State with a two-point lead in the final four minutes of the first half. Good offense that time. And move a little late on the closeout on. Todd 0 for 5. He is Arkansas State's leading scorer. And still without a field goal. White, a little hesitation. Clark, the baseline drive. Good ball movement. Comes back to James. Drive into the basket and one. Through the first couple of months of the season, so they are accustomed to being on the road. Fields, the drive, the dish. Isaiah Nelson, the flush. He's got eight. Quick step out and then maybe a back screen to the rim. Feltz, shot blocked. It is Huntley Hatfield. Someone open on the perimeter. 
Baseline drive, Johnson too strong. Nelson cleans. Good move by Johnson, just took his eye off the rim and again. And his man fell down, here's White the other way. Numbers for Louisville, White all the way and lays it in. Looking at the monitor to see if there was a shot clock issue. Dominguez green lights it. Tap back, it comes to Fields. On the low block, that's Freddie Hicks going to work. And he gets rewarded with two shots. Freddie Hicks is it. Hicks thought about the three, instead finds the open man down low. It's hard to open. Wide open. There was no one within five feet of him, and he's standing right next to the rim. And it's on all the players because obviously they've been taught how to defend the pick and roll. I mean, if you're going to double the pick and roll, somebody has to rotate down. Again, in the paint, again. Arkansas State's largest lead of the game was seven. Fields, the basket, the foul, and a chance to extend to seven. Hicks, they are taking the ball to the basket. Good help position, and they're not moving their feet off the bounce. Largest lead of the game for the Red Wolves. White contested, it comes to Hicks. There's the three. And Arkansas State with a double-digit lead. Tyler Johnson in there with the three fouls. Drives to the rim, gets the two, and that snaps a 9-0 run by the Red Wolves. Guarded by the freshman, veteran and Greenhorn. Down the lane, Hicks again. A game-high 16 for the junior. Nice job by Hicks, just sliding into the lane. And Arkansas State making that extra pass if Louisville overhelps. There's Johnson off balance with a nice balance. Ford using the shot fake. They are attacking the paint. They do it again. Dominguez denied. Clark rejected. Three on two for Arkansas State ahead of the pack. The tip is there on by Dominguez on the second try. Passes out of a double team. 15 to shoot. White, the dribble drive. He gets that one, but Tim, that's kind of been the story for Louisville. Everyone's got to get involved, and you see it in their assist-to-turnover ratio. It's just not good enough. Meanwhile, everything falling. Yeah, it was a little tight in there. The pass was a little behind him. It's tough for that big guy to catch that ball in traffic off the bounce, but at least they're trying to get him involved. Hicks. Dominguez. Came out with no real intensity on defense and tried to find that right unit down the stretch, but they got back in the game, but it was too late. Shot clock down to five. Tough shot in traffic. Offensive rebound, Nelson. Putback is there. They have not hit one tonight. 0 for 9. Dominguez sweeps in. Uncontested. Clark kicks it out to James. He'll pass on the three. And James will have a chance at the three the old-fashioned way. In the painted area, no, the flush by Nelson. Back side of that zone just collapsed and got, in, got into the middle, into the... Back in the man-to-man, -man, trying to put a little pressure on the perimeter and all the way to the rim. You've got Arkansas State sagging their defense in, so when Louisville tries to drive, there's a lot of congestion. On the other end, the Red Wolves hit from the outside. Curtis Williams guarding fields, another blow by, and another chance at a three-point play. Caleb Fields has been a man 
three in 271 consecutive games. Todd, completely uncontested again. The amazing thing, Anisius Louisville had a two-point lead at halftime. And this, they came out of the locker room just with no enthusiasm and no real game plan defensively to play the right way. And then, you, then you've got to do more than soul searching. You've got to find a way to find that fire, find that special group, maybe. Jovanovic throws it up. Okorafor drops it in. Final 30 seconds. Arkansas State about to knock off Louisville by double digits as Hersey Miller. Louisville led by two at the break. Arkansas State shot 51% from the field after halftime.